Um, hi everybody. <laughs> As you can see, it's been a while yet again. Um, yeah, I'm really sorry about that. So, I didn't keep any of my promises that I was going to make. Um, so yeah, that kind of sucks. But, um, what's important is I'm back. And today we're going to be playing my favorite game of all time, uh, Dead by Daylight. <laughs> so, as you can see today, I'm just playing as Yui, and I've got this loadout set up, I got my lightweight set up, I got poised, and I got iron will, and I got any means necessary, and I got my escape cake. So what we're going to do is we're just going to play some games, and we're going to see if we can survive. <laughs> now I will let you guys know ahead of time that I have not played this game in a couple weeks up oh, we got some e-daters by the way i have not played this game in a couple weeks so it's bound to be an interesting session okay so i know the burning question on everyone's minds right now is a uh, trivial where the hell have you been um i don't really have a good answer for you because i've mostly just been you know doing my own thing aka doing everything but basically youtube i've still been playing games i've still been hanging out with my friends i've been you know, uh, touching some grass, I've been playing some Fortnite unironically, and I, that's pretty much it. I mean, I don't really have another excuse for you. I plan to come back, I plan to do some things. Um, I don't plan to do any long retrospective videos anymore like I did with my Lux Wonder YouTube video, but you'll see a lot more gaming videos. I might start streaming pretty soon, so you'll get to... Excuse me? Oh, it's the... Is that the new killer? Yeah, so another burning question I know you guys have is, uh, have you faced the new killer yet? Uh, yeah, a few times. Oh my god. I is, uh, yeah, I faced him a few times. Um, it's not been very good every time I faced him because I don't understand how his power works because I haven't really cared. Oh no, he knows I'm here. It's because I haven't really cared to learn about him, but the problem is... You're stupid. I know I can't blind him with a flashlight. As I was trying to say, like, three times a minute ago... <laughs> is that I haven't really learned how to play against him just yet. I know that he's basically like a kind of a mix of the Plague and the Huntress. Oh, of course he has Jinra. So what I'm trying to do now is I'm going to see if I can learn how to play against him, and I'm going to see if, more importantly, I can survive a single game, okay? That's going to be our challenge for the video. How are we going to survive a single game? If I survive a game, then I'll still play another, but if it takes me forever to survive a game, then I will just stop the video. All right, come on. Does the 360 work? No, it doesn't. Okay, I'm bad at this game, by the way. I have two hours, by the way. I don't think there's a pallet over here. Hi, guys. Um, yeah, go, go. No, he's not, he's not going to take the bait. So as you guys can see, uh, not a very good start to our game. I mean, we still have full flashlight battery. We have four gens left. Uh, one of our teammates has been hooked, including me now. And uh, that's not very good. This Leon is doing the gen right next to me. And he is like so mad that I sandbagged him earlier. He's not even trying to come save me. And I honestly can't blame him. I mean, he just got off the hook and I ran that hand over to him. I think the Ada is more forgiving though. So Ada, you're forever my goat. Can you get me before tier two? Holy. Oh, wait, hold on. There's an apparition to get rid of. Ada, I hear you running away. Ada, Ada, come back. No. Ada, come back. I'm sorry. Ada. Oh, he's here. Ada, did you bring a friend? But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna save Kate. He's gonna pick up, and I'm not gonna try to flashlight save because I'm better than that. And what I'm gonna do instead is I'm going to go do another gen on the opposite side of the map because I am. A pro Dead by Daylight gamer? I make this full loop around. Oh shit. Oh no, he missed. He's bad. Okay. I'm literally the best player of this game ever. No, no. Okay. I'm literally the greatest player that Dead by Daylight will ever know. Can I blind him? Okay, yeah. The unknown's really weird, man. This game is weird, and I haven't been playing for like only like two months. Like, I don't really understand what's going on. Stop it. Well, I'm glad that they got me before I went to tier two before. <laughs> oh, Leon's here. I can't even do my full inspirational quote. I've been injured this entire fucking game, Leon. Please help me. Where's the... Oh, there he is. I'm going to do something that's called, uh... I call it the not my problem maneuver. When I run away from the killer instead of uh, helping out. So what we're going to do, I'm going to show you how to do it, okay? So you see that? So you see that? It's called uh, not my problem. I'm going to go get the hooked survivor instead. Okay, I want you guys to use that strategy. Call it the trivial tech, because it's not my problem. I, it didn't really work on this guy, but we're going to uh, find out real soon that it's actually going to work on the next killer that we face, because I'm about to die. Kate? Kate, I swear to God. Kate? Kate, I got you. Okay. 
I'm so good at this game. Okay, now I'm going to need the unknown to not come here. Nope, he's right there. Okay. Is he going to tunnel her? Yeah, he is. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the other side of the map because that's uh, not my problem. I will get rid of this guy, though. And he's already here. You see, I'm not really good at this game when it's a killer that I can't bully. So, like, you'll have to forgive me. <laughs> I'm going to get this Ada real quick. Because that's what good teammates do. Leon, I have her. Okay, we're just going to have a full-on reunion here? Okay. There's gonna be, oh my fucking god. We're going to have a full-on class of DBD 2018 reunion? Okay. Well, I'm going down here. Okay, so uh, that last game didn't really go that good. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run the... Uh, uh, I'll be the... This cosmetic of Kate. And then we're going to play another game. And I'm going to play as Kate because she's my uh, lucky survivor. Sometimes. Okay. What? That is not possible. <laughs> what? All right. Well, they brought the offering for it, so I can't really be surprised. I can already tell you what's going to happen this game is that, uh, <laughs> none of us are going to get out alive. <laughs> I'm coming. Is that the clown? Yeah, that's the clown. My uh. drunk uncle Jeff is here. He's about to tell us all his stories about Vietnam. Have I ever told anyone how much I hate this map? I mean, it's wide open, so it's not really, you know, fun. And there's all these, like, you know, like, black pools of, like, liquid coming out of the ground. I know it's like the artist crow power juice thing. So it's kind of lore accurate, but at the same time, I'm not really too happy about it because it's kind of gross. So I know everyone came to watch the quality uh, chase gameplay, but uh, I know better than to uh, be chased by a clown. So what we're going to do is, like, avoid that as much as possible. I don't think I'm going to be avoiding that as much as possible. He's coming. And go this way. And I'm gonna run this way. Okay, yep. I am actually goaded at this game, by the way. Okay, they got her off the hook. Efficiency. So I'm trying to find where this Kate... Oh, there she is. And what I'm gonna do is, if he didn't see me... I came in like a wrecking ball. I've never hit so hard in love. Oh, I ran to a wall. I don't even know why I, scre <laughs> I screamed Miley Cyrus lyrics there. Um, I might have brain damage. That's not too close. All right, off the hook. You want me to heal you? Yeah, okay, let's do this real quick. Uh, quick, speed up. All right, see, that took like no time at all. Come on, Kate, let's go. Clown. No, oh, clown, come here. Oh my God, bro. Yes. It was kind of a bad idea to take you here though because I don't really have anything here. Because what we're not gonna do is we're not gonna throw a blank at me. Okay. I have no chance of ever dodging that. I'm actually awful at this game. I don't know where I'm going. Kate, army, help me. Kate. I got you, Kate. Homie. Oh my god, I'm. Because usually, can you not do that? Because usually I'm like the one who Instant karma, my guy. Instant karma. Shut up, Instant shut up, karma, shut up. dude. See, shut up. No, don't get mad at me for that. What? I got you. Nope, I don't got you. I lied. Sorry. Trivial actually sucks at Dead by Daylight. He's not as good as he claims he is. He doesn't actually have 2k hours. He's pretending this whole time. I can have time to pull this off. Can I do this? No. Okay. That was the worst. That's a long stun he was in over there. Did you guys see that? Surprise. Yeah. Okay. Time to go. Dude, you were going to get the hit on me anyway. I don't really know why you stressed it. Uh, what do I have? BPS? Okay. I was just making sure I had some stuff that I could get some blood points with in the chance that I die here. Kate? Kate, you're a legend? What? Kate? Kate? Why did you come back? They're all gonna kill themselves around me? <laughs> Excuse me. I don't much appreciate this. Time to go. Okay, well, now he's just being an ass. Okay. No. No. Watch this. Oldest trick in the book. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, I screamed, so I kind of gave it away. Oh, he doesn't care, though. Wait, do they have, do they have buckle up for the people? <laughs> okay, so my new plan is I'm just going to sit here and I'm going to repair this generator with this other Kate. And um, that's going to be the end of it, because I have adrenaline. And before adrenaline gets, you know, changed, I don't know if it's going to be nerfed into the ground or not, I've heard that it's changing. 
Um, we're gonna use it. We're gonna use it and abuse it. Okay, they're both across the map. Great. They're both ten feet apart from each other because they're not gay. God, I I love it when the doors spawn like this. That's so good. This game is so good because the doors spawn on the same side of the map. Honestly, when the doors spawn like this, I mean, why isn't there just one door at that point? Because any killer can easily patrol the two doors like that, right? Like that defeats the entire purpose of there being more than one door at that point. I don't see the I don't see the reason. He may be a bit dumb? Question mark. No, he's a genius. No, he's dumb. He doesn't see me. Okay. Yeah, you go back to that door, boy. No, I'm not. Is he blind? I mean, there's no head. No head. Unless Kate comes like a godsend in the next two seconds. I use. I could really use a Kate right now. He has a special place in his heart for me. I'm really happy about that. Ah, yes, the game. My favorite map. Unironically, like. Yeah, that, that was kind of like a shit post, but like, unironically, this is one of my favorite maps in the game. I mean, I will defend any indoor map in the game, as long as it's Larry's or the game. But yeah, I'll defend any indoor map, as long as it's this one or Larry's. I cannot defend Midwitch, and I cannot defend Hawkins. I know people like Hawkins, but my hot take for the month is I cannot stand playing on Hawkins. That was like the only good part of Stranger Things being kicked out of the game a few years ago, is that we lost Hawkins. Honestly, we lost, but I won. You know what I mean? What are you doing? Oh, hey. Okay, yeah, time to go. Can I do it? Can I do it? Are you guys ready? Okay, so maybe I'm not off to a good start, okay? Maybe I'm not off to a good start. Okay. So, yeah, this lobby had some high prestige Cheryl's in it, so I was kind of really hoping that we'd have a really good game. But it appears that uh, that's not going to be the case because we're playing against a legion. <laughs> How do you manage to stay calm during all this? Well, the fact is I really don't take it that deep, man. It's dead by daylight. This game's always going to piss people off and it's going to piss me off too. And I've just come to accept that. 99% of the time when I play this game, I go in and I'm like, I'm going to play against a legion. I'm going to play against a hag. I'm going to play against, uh, I don't know, what's another annoying one? Singularity. I'm going to play against this killer. So whenever I get to the point where I play against him, I'm like, eh, okay, that kind of sucks. But, you know, I'll deal with it. And that's what I'm doing right now. I don't get mad because I'm just like, yeah, I've, I have like 1.8k hours in this game, okay? I really don't care. <laughs> you know, I just can't believe that we got a match with two Silent Hill fans. Remember that time I played Silent Hill and I played a whole series on that? <laughs> Are you guys even ready for the sickest comeback of all time? After I get the Legion off my ass. You can put me in basement. Basement's right there, buddy. Okay, no, we're in, up, up, up. Are you doing, oh, no, what do you do? Oh. Is he letting me go? If he puts me on back hook, I might actually get off. Hold on. Put me on back hook. Aw. Yes, Cheryl. Yes, you and me, we're going to win this game. Okay? No! You just have to stick with me. Okay, bye. Um, we're just not going to stick together then. Okay, so what we're going to do is I'm going to do this gen alone. And I'm going to repair to that, and then I'm going to go to another gen. Never let them know your next move, okay? Cha-cha real smooth on them. You know what's really funny is that I'll follow the rules for, you know, healing simulator against Legion, right? Because it's, you know, basically common fact in the uh, DBD good player community that uh, Legion, that Legion, ugh, that Legion is going to be a healing simulator game, right? You're not going to be able to heal against them because you'll always be able to instantly injure you and put you into that status effect, right? And it's also agreed upon that the plague is treated the same way. Just be injured the whole game, be one shot, just completely lose any sense of stealth against her. But the real problem with that statement is that the plague is kind of like the worst. People really hype her up to be like one of the best killers in the game. She's like kind of like, oh my god, and she's kind of like not good at all. Like, I really think that she needs a free work ahead of time, honestly, because the fact that she can get her power from one fountain is just kind of intense, man. You know, and behaviors running around, you know, changing killers like the Huntress, for some reason, who people finally started agreeing upon was pretty much one of the most balanced killers in the game, because she's actually kind of like the most reasonable to play against. Because, you know, you play against her, and you're like, well, there's going to be some stupid gameplay, there's going to be some awesome gameplay, or overall it's just going to really suck. So what's going to happen instead is uh, we're just going to face her, and we're going to suck it up. We're gonna suck up the instant down hatchets. We're gonna suck up the uh, the bad are it the bad hitboxes. And we're gonna suck it up. But what we just now finally agreed upon is that no, she's actually bad. So we have to change her now, which doesn't really make much sense to me, especially when you have killers like the Skull Merchant just you know pretty much existing in the game. Oh my god, this guy's still on me. So what basically happens is you're nerfing killers that really don't need to be changed at all. 
and I don't really understand why. Because people are like, oh, they're only sucking up to the, oh my god. They're only sucking up to the high tier players. They're sucking up to the low tier players. No, they're not. They're not listening to anyone. <laughs> and we need to really stop the whole killer main versus survivor main, you know, uh, you, their team, our team kind of thing. And just team up against behavior, man. Because, like, there's not... Because there is a such thing as, like, nerfing the killers too much or nerfing the survivors too much. And I don't think it's as common as people complain it is anymore. Because I know some people were like, oh, well, why did they change mate for this? And why did they change... And why are they going to change uh, for the people in Buckle Up? And I'm like... Those are fundamentally broken perks. <laughs> Made for this in the hands of a, like, good player? Like, that will make all the difference in a chase. At the end of the day, you're trying to get more people to play this game, right? You want the game to last longer, get more people. So stop making things that are, like, unpopular decisions with the community, like changing the hunters for no reason. Okay, so that rant's over. I wanted to talk about that because I want to really start, like, a conversation about something Dead by Daylight related. I'm kind of, like, going through, like, a DVD withdrawal, and I kind of, like, don't want to be. I want that heroin in my veins right now. So, like, come on, let's talk about it. I'm so sick of seeing your stupid face. Franklin, I am so sick of seeing you. This Cheryl's probably not gonna make it out. Let's just let's just let's just come to terms with that. And I kinda said, you know, neither of us are gonna make it out of this game. And guess what's happening? None of us are making it out. Oh my god, dude. Do you even have Lightborn? Yes he does. No, yeah, he does. Okay. Hi, what are you doing? I'm going to uninstall this game, dude. <laughs> All right, you guys want me to play some uh, Fortnite instead? You, want, you guys want me to play some Friday before that goes away? We're gonna do that instead. Okay, well, pfft. do you guys see what I deal with? <laughs> do you guys see what I deal with for your content's sake? All right, well, she's dead, so we're gonna hope for Hatch to spawn, and if Hatch spawns, then video's over. Not then. Video is like, why are you going upstairs? Hatch doesn't spawn. Okay. Okay, well, that's the end game. I can try to outlast him for the rest of the match. And I could also just, like, try to open a door and get killed. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to open a door and get killed. Surprise, motherfucker! Oh, hey, there he is. Hi. You want to talk about it? No! Want to talk our relationship through Legion? No! Because, frankly, I don't think I'm satisfied with how this relationship's going, Legion. Like, you, you seem to, like, you know, like, be on, like, different wavelengths recently, and I don't really agree with how we're feeling about each other. Okay. What I'm going to do is I'm going to run. I'm going to go downstairs. I'm going to hug the left. No pallet there. There's never a pallet on either side of the stairs anymore. That's always great. I'm going to drop the conveniently placed god pallet early. He's not going to use his power because he's awesome. He's actually kind of like chill now. I, I kind of f***ed with this heavy. So I'm going to run over here instead. I'm going to use this kick pallet. And then we're just going to uh, just do that. Yeah. I didn't say I'd make it easy on you. Yeah. Come on. I'm just going to feed him some pallets for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I'm going to drop my flashlight, so I don't want that. All right. Come on, Pookie. Give me some kisses. Give me some kisses. I'm going to drop that. I don't care. It's the end of the game. I'm gonna vault this. Come on, Legion. Yeah. What do you have to say for yourself? He says yes. Oh. Okay, so as you guys can see, uh, that didn't go too well. <laughs> so my first few games back uh, weren't too fun. I've been recording for about an hour now, so that kind of sucks. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed what I have been able to put the screen for you guys today. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say. Uh, I'll catch you guys in the next episode of whatever the hell I end up doing. Peace out, guys.